hello guys what is up welcome back to my channel if you are new my name is danielle hey what's up subscribe down below if you are new here i post new videos every wednesday and sunday and it would just be like really cool if you like subscribe because then you'll be notified when I post new videos and that'd be really cool. So I'll give you a moment, I'll give you a moment. Anyways, today I'm going to be doing an OG collective haul. If you guys don't know what a collective haul means, it just means a ton of things that you've collected over the past few weeks. Not like, you know, a haul. I know sometimes I do a haul like from one online order I did from like one store, but this is like a ton of different things. I have hair products, I have fun chill like clothes that I bought to like wear to class. I know a lot of you guys are wanting to hear more about like college fashion and like what I wear to class. So I bought a ton of like fun cool stuff to wear to class. Bought a new pair of jeans, bought some a sweater, some cute stuff for like weekends. And I just thought it'd be like a fun thing. Oh, I got some sunglasses. It's a good haul. And of course this will be a try on because I know it's like fun to see the clothes on and everything. So I'll be showing clips of me wearing the items throughout the video. So yeah, without further ado, let's get started. I will have a link to everything that I can find down below that I show, so. And I'll have a link to everything I talk about down below so you guys can shop at yourselves and we can all be shopping addicts together. <laughs> also, do we like this like little filming setup? I'm kind of into it. All right, so from American Eagle, I've recently discovered, thanks to you guys, the American Eagle Curvy line. I, wow, changed the game. I have a very small waist and a larger bottom, so like, Finding jeans that fit both of those categories is very hard. Um, and I was talking about that in a video and you guys were all like, oh my God, you have to try the American Eagle Curvy jeans. And I was like, wow, okay, I'll try them. Fell in love. So I actually have three pairs of jeans now. I have shown two in videos before. They're kind of like more ripped. And then, but the only thing is, so I bought a size four and um, I thought those would like fit perfectly and they fit pretty well, but they're still a little bit big around my waist. And then someone commented that like works at American Eagle. So thanks to you for commenting this, that she usually suggests customers to size, um, go a size down in the curvy line just because they're meant to like be a little bit bigger. They're not meant to look bigger, but they're supposed to, f anyways, size down in them is what she said. So I got a size two in the just like straight mom jeans. These are the ones, I have these with the hole in the knee, but then I just wanted to get the normal pair. These fit like a glove. However, they didn't have any more petites left. They only had regular, which was like the length. I'm 5'3", I'm a little bit shorter. And these, I think I need to get taken up just a little bit because I can roll them up, but I would just love if they hit right above the ankle. Look just so cool je with um sneakers. These pants fit awesome. I love them. They just fit the bum well and also the waist at the same time. So they did a great job with this line. I'm going to continue to purchase jeans from the curvy line because I am here for it. Next up, free people. I am recently obsessed with the big graphic tees with just like chill, fun, loungy tops. I like to wear these to class. Um, I also will wear like sorority tees and stuff, but I'm kind of growing out of it, like wearing like date night shirts and stuff. Um, I really just like getting cool laid back graphic tees or just chill tees. So I went to Free People and I was like, oh, do I want to spend all this money on like, you know, distressed, you know, cool tops. And I really just can't find you know, good quality, cool tops anywhere else. So I spent some money on free people, I can't even lie. But I got some really cool stuff and these are things that I can inspire you guys to wear to class and everything like that, so I'll show you guys. First off, I actually wore this to class today and it was perfect. It's this gray Henley, maybe you would call it. I got it in a size medium, it's from the We The Free brand. This is all free people, why do I even say that? But it's this light gray and I really like the bottom of the um, shirt because it has this like slit on either side and it's very, very flattering. I, I really like how it's not all connected. I don't really know, it sounds really weird but it kind of like splits everything up and it's super flattering. I um, wore it with just like a bralette off the shoulder with like these layer necklaces and it looked really cute. I really, really liked it um, and it's great like fall transition from like summer to fall. Um, and it's awesome and you can wear like another shirt under it if you want and it also the sleeves have thumb holes Big fan next up. I added a little color to the mix. I got this fun um, Pink top or I guess magenta Really I got this in a size small and it's like a higher cut top Like cuffed sleeves a little bit and I just thought this would look really cute either with leggings if I wanted or honestly tucked in to some boyfriend jeans with like a belt and like some necklaces um, for more of like a dressed up like cool funky look. I just like this color I'm trying to infuse more color into my life. Speaking of color. I got this fun top I thought this would be really cool um, I feel like you can wear it a ton of different ways 
it's like it looks more yellow online it's kind of more yellow orange in person um but it's like a mock turtleneck situation but it's just like a tee um and then it also has the slits on the side i thought this would look really good with um like just some cool leggings and boots like when it gets or like jeggings i guess where i could like pop a denim jacket over this and wear some cool layered necklaces i just thought this was a really good layering top honestly or like with a flannel um i just thought it was like a really good fall top and it's like really great quality similar but different to that shirt i got this shirt which is a white short sleeve top with the mock turtleneck once again thought this would look great with some denim jeans and some black boots a vibe um yeah just another chill cool top and i got the same top in a taupe color i wore this the other day got a lot of compliments on it it's just like a funky it's like a spin off of like a casual tee but then it's just got this really cool neckline and it's really flattering next up i got this distressed white top i love this there's like a ton of random little rips i really like the material of this it's really good quality it's got a pocket in the front um so it's like on the neckline and then on the back got even more holes i got this in a size medium um they said they run big and they definitely run big i probably should have got a size small but it's white and like oversized white things i think are really really cute um so yeah this is like a perfect one to wear to class and then i also got the same top in like a black gray color but i got this in a size small because it said it ran small or ran big so i wanted to see what a small was like so i've got two different fits for this top but this is what the black one looks like um you can see the distressedness a little bit better with this color i think this is going to be great with like some gold necklaces kind of like this um and jeans or leggings once again whatever you want for class or to dress it up with some jeans shorts if it's Warm enough still where you are to wear jean shorts with it, a vibe. I love this top. I envision myself wearing this with just like leggings and boots like on like a cold day with like a scarf. It's a great layering piece. It's kind of like a waffle net top. Um, just a white long sleeve. The quality is amazing. It's like stretchy, super, super comfortable. Um, I love the buttons in the front. I thought this was just gonna be a perfect top for class. Or again, I could wear it with jeans and like, I don't know, maybe some brown booties. Or like um, thigh high boots. I don't know. There's so many things I want to do with this shirt. Wow, that sounded a little weird. Oh, I love this top from Free People. It is so cute. It's this like a little bit of a lighter sweater. So again, I got it as like kind of a transition from summer to fall to wear to class or like out with friends because it's a little bit more funky. It's this pink off the shoulder um, sweater with like a on one side it's cold shoulder though, and it's really 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 cute i love the big bell sleeves um and then it just cinches at the bottom it's kind of like it feels like a wild fox sweater like quality wise but then it's like a little bit funkier on the neckline and super cute got this in a size medium got the light pink delaney hello hey i'm filming so yeah love this top i'm so excited to wear it all the time and then i got three bralettes because i'm realizing that i either wear sticky boobs bralettes or no bras honestly with tops um so i needed some more bralettes in my life so they have really good quality ones i love this one i've worn it like so much already i just got this light pink one every bralette i'm showing you guys they have in like a thousand colors like light pink nude one um it's kind of like a tank but not really it's a little bit shorter it's just so comfortable like you can even just wear it to bed it's awesome love the v-neck and then i got this one which is like a little bit of a different style and it's gray show this these are just so nice to wear with like those shirts i showed you guys or under like a graphic tee um very very simple but like really chill good stuff and then the last one is like this nude one it's a little bit more structured um and it just looks like this so yeah, that's everything I got from Free People. This shirt is not from Free People. It's from Urban Outfitters, but they're like owned by the same company. So I don't know, I just thought I'd tell you guys. This. From Red Dress Boutique, I literally was just walking by the one in Athens the other day and I saw this on the mannequin. I was like, that is so cute. It is not cold yet, but when it gets cold, I'm gonna want this sweater. And if it wasn't gonna be there in a week, I'll be really sad. So I got this sweater, love it. I'm still into leopard. I just love the obnoxiousness of this. It's just like a gray sweater um with bell sleeves i got it in a size medium so it's a little bit more chunky fun this i just see going so many different ways so our school colors are red and black so like i could wear this on a colder game day with like a skirt and thigh high boots and like red lipstick and stuff or i could see myself making this a little more chill tucked into like some denim jeans and sneakers to class with like a bun and like gold hoops like a vibe so i just think this is really versatile it's like my first fall sweater i've purchased for the year 
and I'm really looking forward to wearing it. From Selfie Leslie, I got two things. I've been obsessed with their store lately. Um, it's like another Australian online boutique. They just have really cool, fun stuff. Just like cute, fun, trendy pieces. I got this skirt. I wore it to my boyfriend's uh, fraternity date night. It was like a band party, so I just needed like a fun skirt. So I found this one, and it is so cute. It's this happy red color. I love the ruffles. It's a great, again, transition from summer to fall. I think this would be really cute with like a white sweater, or like I wear this with a white bodysuit, but if it was like cold out, you could like pop a denim jacket over and wear it with some booties. Um, go so many different ways with it, but I loved like the print on it. Good skirt, good yeah, skirt. It's really pretty top that you'll have to wear like a bralette under it because it's a little bit sheer, but I just thought this was so beautiful for the fall time. It's a little bit cropped um, and it like has a little bit of a V. It can like be kind of off the shoulder if you wanted it to, um, but it's just like a really, really pretty blouse. I thought I'd wear jeans and boots. I just don't have a lot of really pretty blouses like this and I thought this was really unique. I got two pairs of sunglasses. I do, I, I'm sorry, I did it, I did it. I'm obsessed with sunglasses. I wear sunglasses every day. I wear sunglasses when I drive. I find them to be like kind of like an accessory for your outfit, so that's how I justify buying sunglasses. Anyways, I'm obsessed with Ray-Bans. I'm like a Ray-Ban collector, and they had a deal on Ray-Ban like on their website, like buy one, get one like 20% off or something, so I did it. And there's this new style of Ray-Ban. They're the Blaze Aviators. I got two pairs because I'm obsessed with them. The first pair are these. They're just like the dark green lenses with the gold hardware I just like so basically the they're aviators but they're a little bit bigger they're a little thinner than their standard aviator and then they have this big obnoxious gold bar on top and I just I like this look a lot I think they're just like a good everyday sunglasses a good everyday sunglass <laughs> that makes sense and then I got the same exact pair but in all black with like a black gradient um, lens so they're just literally all black but I thought these were kind of like a good spin off of their normal black aviators and just something a little bit more fun they kind of remind me of key sunglasses a little bit i just i'm a big ray-ban fan i always have been and i really really like how these look on me so yeah i'll have those linked down below they're like a newer style and i saw a lot of people wearing them and i checked them out myself lastly i recently got my hair done and i'm really trying to take really good care of my hair because I like being blonde and I want to keep my hair healthy so it's really hard to do that so um, I got my hair done at Tribe Hair Company in Athens if you guys were wondering and they carry a ton of products they carry Olaplex and Olaplex is like a really if you guys get your hair done recently a lot of hair salons have been using those products um, so I got the Olaplex shampoo and conditioner basically what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use these shampoo and conditioner every other time I wash my hair and then every other time I wash my hair I'm gonna use my purple shampoo so she said I shouldn't be using purple shampoo every time I shampoo which is what I was doing so this is just super these are like bond maintenance um, these are the bond maintenance shampoo and conditioner they repair strengthen and hydrate all hair types they're really really good for people that have like damaged hair or use color and it's great and then I also am gonna try out the Olaplex number six bond smoother it's a leave-in reparative styling cream cream you put it in like your damp hair before you style it so I really want to take good care of my hair once I get like a good hair care routine down I'll definitely make a video I'm just honestly still figuring it out that's everything I got I wanted to show you guys I just thought it was like a fun little I don't know I like sitting down and talking honestly as an excuse to talk in front of the camera but love you guys so much thanks so much for watching subscribe if you are new here and I'll see you guys next time for our next video